Alright y'all, this is gonna be the last video of the day because I gotta go out and do some work. But you know I'm on Facebook because y'all see me, right? Let's talk about some grown up shit, right? For real. Cause I don't understand. Maybe my life is different from yours. And this is what I mean. I'm talking about everybody out here exposing everybody. You know what I'm saying? Dudes out here showing pictures of they girl, they exes and stuff, telling all they secrets. And ain't just dudes, but it's women, y'all exposing men and stuff, telling out all they secrets. And it ain't got to be none of that nasty, freaky stuff. But if somebody into something, as soon as y'all break up, you go back and tell his enemy this or, you know, all that goofy stuff. And then I look at my life, and it ain't perfect. Let me just say, it ain't perfect. I had some good relationships and some bad relationships. But one thing that you ain't going to be able to find on this book, there's no women telling my secrets. Mm-mm. And you don't see me telling no women's secrets. Mm -mm. That's what grown people do. Well, not even grown, because you could be a kid, a teenager. You ain't supposed to be doing that. It's called maturity. Now, I still talk to people I knew since high school and grammar school, some exes. We still cool. Just because y'all don't get along for as a relationship, don't mean y'all can't be friends. I'm just saying, all this exposing, that really shows what type of person you is. And if I see somebody that I like in the initiative, and then I can find stuff where they're exposing other people or, you know, just being real messy during the breakup, that's a turnoff. I have seen a lot of women, I'd be like, nah, I can't mess with her. Mm -mm, she too messy for me. And don't get me wrong, she had no business, but this social media just went crazy with people. You know, everything don't go on here. Some things, like, like um, you know how your mommies tell you what happened at home, stay at home? Some of this shit need to just stay at home behind closed doors. Now, don't get me wrong. Some stuff, you're going to have to go get some counseling for it. Don't just keep it under the rug. But you ain't got to let the whole world know about it. I mean, let me just, let me make some clarification about this. If there's some sexual assault type shit, then... Yeah, somebody need to know. But I mean, some of this stuff don't need to be on social media. You know? So let's 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 tighten up our social media. Figure out what social media really was designed for to network. There is too many people on social media to not to be able to network with. You know, think about it. Say you got a product that you selling or a service, and you network with a hundred people a week from different states. I mean, we got to we got to give here where we don't have to network with the people just in our community. We can go state to state with this internet. We could, man, we could we could be so powerful. And I'm using it to my ability. Let me just say that. That's why y'all see me on this highway. I be all over the place because I be networking with people. I take my skills all over. And that's what we got to do. We just got to learn how to network better and not be messy better. It's called network. Oh, excuse me. Um, it's almost 12 o'clock this time. I'm supposed to be on the highway. I got to go to Indiana. All right.